Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Star Flames. In this video, we're gonna talk about ESPN returning Emmy Awards and disciplining some of their staff members according to reports. Now, this is because it is said that there were people from the ESPN department who submitted fake names to the award organization in a bid to secure trophies for um, on-air personalities who had been ineligible to receive them. Now, um, if you're not aware, ESPN had their biggest win um, of Emmy Awards back in 2023. They won a total of 13 Sports Emmy Award. Now, so far, they have won 246 Sports Emmy Award in the 36 years that they have been eligible to win. And this has surpassed its own record for the most win in 2023 so what is happening why would they do this well they're saying that this is a fraud that was um they were able to detect back to 1997 right espn said in a statement acknowledging that members of its team were clearly wrong for you know concocting this scheme they're saying that some members of our team were clearly wrong in submitting certain names that may go back to 1997 in Emmy categories where they were not eligible for recognition or statuettes. An ESPN spokesperson said in a statement, they're saying this was a misguided attempt to recognize on here individuals who were important members of our production team once current leadership was made aware and they're saying that they apologize for doing this. Now, the last time I checked, it is said that well, over 30 Emmy Awards were returned up to that point. Now, guys, this is definitely not coming as any surprise, to be very honest, because especially when we look at, you know, Young Miami and Didi with Young Miami winning the BET Awards over some of the top um, podcast um, blog, um, channels or blog sites, you can definitely tell that this is something that people, once they have the right connection and know how, they know what to do. Now, I must say that I do also understand that BET Awards is different from the Emmys, but I believe that at the end of the day, a lot of people knows what strings to pull in order to get things working out in their favor, having things their way. So I thought that this would be a good share based on everything that is being exposed so far this year as it relates to Hollywood and the industry. So guys, let me know what are your thoughts about this. While you're at it, give this video a big thumbs up. Share if you care. Stay safe, stay blessed, and see you all later. Peace.